Hello Internet World, Johnny R here. Welcome back to Bloons TD6. Uh, we're going to go to Monkey Meadow. Easy. And we're going to do Primary and Deflation today. Alright. Cool. Take Quincy, place him right here. Take a dart, place it right here. And then we'll start. We only need to go to round 40, so there's not much to worry about. Okay. Quincy is most of it handled in the beginning. Long range and enhanced eyesight for the dart. That'll guarantee that we can deal with the camos. Alright, what's next? Bomb tower, we'll place it... Hmm. Yeah, we'll place it right here. Set it to strong. Now to make sure we're, we could deal with the uh, leads. Yeah. And yeah, we're still early game, we need XP, so we could place one of each. Can you fit there? Yeah. Cool. Finally, you can go here. Yeah. Cool. Go to the glue, glue soak, and corrosive glue with bigger globs. There we go. Round 16, crossbow. Quick shots and very quick shots. Very good. Ooh, we can level up again. Sweet. Relentless glue, nice. That's a good one. We just level up the rest over here, right? get the rest later. Let me see if I can show it to you slowly. Yeah, there we go. Glaive Ricochet allows it to bounce along the balloons, which is really cool. Yeah, there we go. You can kind of see it. Whoops. <laughs> Come on, Mouse. There we go. Very good. Reload, Miss Launcher, Mod Mauler. Bigger bombs and heavy bombs. Very strong. Karma Frost, Cold Snap. radius, refreeze, and then we're going to save it for the cryo cannon. So instead of doing this AoE, it can shoot little snowballs at the uh, balloons and freeze them that way. There we go. 
Very cool. Yeah. Faster shooting, even faster shooting. Hot shots, along with long range attacks and super range attacks. Very good. Just for safety, we're going to take a dart, place it right here. Sharp shots, raise sharp shots, spike a pulp, and then juggernaut, along with long, long range darts and enhanced eyesight. And that's just in case any ceramics get by at the end of round 40. Should be fine though. Just be safe, let's place down another bomb and uh, give it these. Ooh, yep, we got it. Nothing to be afraid of. Okay. Now next up, deflation. In this mode, you start off with a whole bunch of money, but you can't earn any more. Gotta make it to round 60. So here we go. Place Quincy there, a dart here, give it Juggernaut, long range and enhanced eyesight. Uh, let's see, sniper, go here. Full metal jacket, large caliber, deadly precision, night vision goggles, shrapnel shot. And uh, we'll go with a druid. Yeah. Thorn Storm, Heart of Oak, Druid of the Jungle, Hard Thorns, and Heart of Thunder. And then we'll put a spike factory back here, and we'll level it up. Long reach, bigger stacks, with white hot spikes. Whew. What else? We'll take an alchemist, put it this close to the druid, and only the druid. Large potions, acidic mixture dip. Strong acid, perishing potions. And let's see where we go from there. Oh, level up. Oben, greenfoot, yeah. Ah, uh, yeah. We've got a bomb shooter, we'll place it here. Fast reload, missile launcher, we'll have mauler. Set to strong. Extra range and frag bombs. That should be sufficient. For round 40. You can barely see anything, you know? Ooh, alright. Smart spikes. Here we go. We'll set the close. As you can see here, Druid of the Jungle, it creates these uh, spiky vines that deal damage as blooms go over them. So that's really good. Plus, it kind of grabs a balloon and crushes it. Like that. It's a little hard to see, but that's what it does. Alright. Getting around 40. Oh yeah, hmm. very good. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I guess we should XP farm a little bit, huh? And that's all we can do, unfortunately. 
Should be fine though. Oh yeah, the cool thing about, um, villages is that they can give, um, camo detection to whatever towers in the radius. So if you put the village next to the druid here and give it camo detection, these spikes can now hit the camouflage balloons, which is really good. I usually like doing that combination. Right. Can I do it? Berserker Brew, yes. Can't do it yet, but Berserker Brew allows him to do extra damage, extra range, and attack speed. Which is great for the Druid of the Jungle. Because that means those thorns on the ground also do more damage. It's very nasty. Oh yeah. We're almost done. Just a little bit longer. Spike factory. Long life spikes. And even faster production. Whew. Pretty awesome. I thought at least one would get by. Then they gotta deal with this big pile of spikes here. Two more rounds ago. Here we go. Excellent. All right. Not so bad. Cool. Next episode, we're going to be doing the media maps. So I hope to see you there. All right. So this is Johnny R signing off for the night. Have a good night, everyone.